Hey guys, welcome. Today we are going to see stepper motor interfacing with DRV8825, along with microstepping. Don't forget to subscribe for more updates. At the heart of the DRV8825 driver you will find a chip made by Texas Instruments, the DRV8825 stepper motor controller IC. This integrated motor driver makes interfacing with the microcontroller super easy as you only need two pins to control both the speed and the direction of the stepper motor. The sketch starts with defining the step and direction pins. I connected them to Arduino pin 2 and 4. The statement constant int used to give a name to a constant value. The compiler will replace any references to this constant with the defined value when the, the program is compiled. So everywhere you mention direction pin, the compiler will replace it with the value 2 when the program is compiled. In the setup, section of the code, all the motor control pins are declared as digital output with the function pin mode. In the loop, section of the code, we let the motor spin one revolution slowly in the clockwise direction and one revolution quickly in the counterclockwise direction. To control spinning direction. To control the spinning direction of the stepper motor we set the DIR, direction, pin either high or low. For this we use the function digital right. Depending on how you connected the stepper motor, setting the DIR pin high will let the motor turn clockwise or clockwise direction. To control number of steps or revolutions. For loops control the number of steps the stepper motor will take. The code within the for loop results in one step of the stepper motor. Because the code in the loop is executed 3000 times. To control speed. The speed of the stepper motor is determined by the frequency of the pulses we send to the step pin. The higher the frequency, the faster the motor runs. You can control the frequency of the pulses by changing delay microseconds in the code. The shorter the delay, the higher the frequency, the faster the motor runs. Here is the circuit diagram of DRV8825 and Arduino UNO, make the connection as shown in the schematic. Before turning on the power supply, check once or twice, I have burnt one driver with a small mistake. By interchanging the VCC and ground. Now let's dump the code to Arduino. Connect the USB cable to Arduino and compile the code. Once when compiling is completed, upload the code. My COM port was not detected, so I reconnected back. Then it worked properly. I was checking whether the IC is getting heated up frequently, due to my previous mistake of interchanging VCC and ground. And uploading got completed, let's see the output. Hum. I forgot to say that there is a variable resistor on the driver, you have to set the current by varying it. Once when the current is set the motor starts rotating. You can even control the motor vibration noise also by the variable resistor. By controlling the current to be passed to the motor. Stepper motors typically have a step size of 1.8 degrees or 200 steps per revolution. This refers to full steps. A microscaping driver such as the DRV8825 allows higher resolutions by allowing intermediate step locations. This is achieved by energizing the coils with intermediate current level. The motor rotates in full step. The motor is rotating in half step.
Now the motor rotates in one fourth step. Now I'm changing the microscapes to 1.8. Now the step resolution is 1 by 16. For rest of the modes the speed remains same as 1 by 32 step. You can have a look of it. I have removed the switches, and M0, M1 and M2 are open, so it's in full step mode. Thank you don't forget to subscribe, I will get back with new video.